Hello guys and welcome back to Cat Dog Pick Duck plays on the TPPI server. Welcome back guys! Hey, if you happen to look behind me here, you'll notice I have a crap ton of pink wool. So, needless to say, the updates that we've made on our pink wool production are doing quite well. Look at all that wool. So this is more than enough to fully power us only using pink wool. Um, basically, we can go ahead and shut down this pink dye production that we have here and maybe use that uh, golem farm we have over here for, you know, like food or something else. Let me click this real quick. There we go. <laughs> um, so yeah, guys, um, I went ahead and made a little update to this farm here and have I have it producing wheat and I move these cactus over here and that's fully in range of this guy so he's now harvesting those and I also put some nether work here and I think it's working out pretty good we've got a good collection of things and now I seem my main food source seems to be this sweet corn yum 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 very good so cool we are now completely powered by pink wool our whole base and everything weird <laughs> excuse me Ha! My bad. My allergies are still bugging me quite a bit. So yeah, um, other things you may have noticed is, uh, and I'll go ahead and say it, we've updated the server, or I didn't update it, uh, Daximus did. He updated the server to the latest software. So we've got updated mods. Um, Burt Reynolds is very happy about that, aren't you? Yes, sir. And uh, we've noticed a few little weird things with the update. Let me close this door real quick. Um, one thing I noticed right away was I was being attacked by creepers almost nonstop. Uh, recently it was my birthday, so Daximus left me a birthday cake right here. It was on a nice table, and it was a nice birthday cake, and it said happy birthday above it. That was very nice of him to do that. And I was like, yay, birthday cake. And then a creeper came right through this door and blew up. He blew up the cake, he blew up the sign, he blew up the table. So I went ahead and installed some security here. These are just fence gates, but this will keep people from walking in. It also keeps Burt Reynolds from going outside at the moment. Sorry, Burt. So yeah, um, things are a little less secure here in the new update. Not a problem. You know, we'll just deal with it. We've, we'll just install these little fence gates here. And over here, as you can see, I added a little um, thermal expansion area with uh my new pink production <laughs> it's so weird it's such a weird thing to say pink production going gangbusters now we can actually go ahead and update these energy cells to redstone energy cells and oh man i think those redstone energy cells hold like two million redstone flux so i'm, I'm excited to do that we're not going to do that this episode um let's see what one thing i did want to do this episode uh, let's take a look here is let's type in glider uh, in the old version of this mod pack the TPPI mod pack gliders were turned off and it's this guy here it's a hang glider it's from open blocks and it's made by a stick and glider wings and glider wings are made like this so let's go ahead and make this guy I've always wanted to mess with this I've seen other people playing with it and I want to play too all right geez why they're by so greedy. All right, so let's make some sticks like so. I think that's gonna be enough and hopefully we have enough leather. If not, we'll just go murder some cows. Here we go. So we need to make two of these wings like so. Ba -ba. And I think this is gonna work really well with my jetpack too. So let's take a look-see here. All right, two glider wings. Uh, we put them like this like that and a stick in the middle oh look at that very cool hang glider so I should just be able to I'm gonna turn off my jetpack oh it's on hover mode I'm gonna turn it off and we've got the jetpack going now let's see what happens if I just jump off the edge here oh look at that oh this is actually pretty quick it doesn't go up it just glides which makes sense right it's a hang glider so let's turn our jetpack back on Okay, this could be a good way to save some jetpack fuel, for sure. Very neat. I wonder what this looks like in F5. Oh, look at that. Oh, weird. Look at me. Whee! 
<laughs> wow. Okay. So cool. Jetpack works pretty good. And I think if I click on it again, I'll just fall with it. Very good. I have my long fall boots on, so I'm not too worried. So, um, one thing I wanted to check out with this hang glider was another item from the portal mod. Let's check this out. Portal. I forget the name of it. I think it's Aerial something. Here it is. Aerial Faith Plate. So we need glass, leadstone, iron, and obsidian. So this guy will fling me into the air. And if I have my... Hey, Burt Riddles, how you doing, buddy? Sorry, I got distracted. Um... So if the aerial faith plate throws me into the air, let's make two of these. Then, and I have the jetpack on, maybe that will be a really cool thing to do. You know, like, I just have one installed outside my door, it flings me into the air, and I get moving at a pretty good speed, hopefully. So let's try this out. Alright, let's make one of these. Let's make two. I, th I have a couple places that would be pretty good to install these, but the main place would just be right out here. So put one like that. Okay. Let's see if we click on it. I want it to throw me as long and far as possible. Needs redstone? No. Okay. So let's turn off our jetpack just real quick. All right. And let's see how far this throws me. Well, that didn't work, did it? Maybe I gotta jump on it. Put on my glider, and that works pretty good. Okay, so I'm gonna turn on my jetpack just so I can get back over there. So that's an interesting thing. Um, I wanna try it maybe without the glider. So let's put the glider off our hotbar, and let's see if this actually, I have some boots in here that have haste on them. Not sure where I put them. Let's go find those real quick. The haste, on my boots, here they are, actually make my jet, pla jet pack fly faster. So I want to try it. See, I'm moving a little faster now, and the jet pack does so accordingly. I wonder if it, this multiplies. No, not really any faster. But it did get me moving. So that's interesting. It could be a good way to save a little fuel. Plus, if any zombies come up here. Oh, I wonder if I can get Burt Reynolds to... to jump on this thing. Oh! <laughs> and he teleports right back. Come here, buddy. Oh! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Burt Reynolds, but we're going to do this all day. Where'd he go? There he is. Look at this. He just keeps teleporting back. If I stand here, will he just go in a loop forever? No, he won't. Come here, buddy. <laughs> okay, that's good fun. That is good fun for everybody. Another place that would be good to put this would be down here on, wait, maybe just right here. Burt Reynolds is teleporting to me, but I am in midair. Let's see if he can get over here. Burt, Burt, where are you Burt? Get away from me creepers. All right, I don't think Burt followed me. Oh, there he is. Yeah, he did follow me. Hey buddy. So very cool. That is a very fun thing to play with. I like those aerial faith plates a lot. I just wish you could maybe like put a motor underneath them and they'd go really far. So let's throw this on just real quick. All right, we've got our glider on. Boom. That works pretty good. Yeah, and these gliders go pretty fast too. And if I hit spacebar with my jetpack, it takes me back up again. So that would be a good way to save on jetpack fuel, which I've probably already said. But very cool. I like, I like these gliders a lot. This is fun. So in the past version of the TPPI server, these gliders were turned off and a few other items as well. So let's see if we can find what other items. And I remember exactly the one I wanted to do, and it has to do with my jetpack here. This jetpack is great, but it costs you on armor. So there's no way to enchant it with armor, you know, like protection or anything like that. So um, let's just type in armored and it should pop right in. An armored jetpack. Look at this, we can upgrade our jetpack, cool. So let's see, we need a steel block. Ooh, that's expensive. Uh, bronze, diamond dust, and yeah, 
and our jetpack. So let's get to that. We've got we've got steel for days. So let's go ahead and make two steel blocks because we have two of these jetpacks, and that's what we want to do. Very good. Um, do I have bronze? I remember cooking some up. Here it is. I also have a lot of quarried stone being cooked here, but this also says it's Tinker Alloy. Tinker's Alloy Ingot. Now, when what I put in this redstone furnace was bronze dust, and I'm hoping they're the same thing. So the next thing we need to do is crush up some diamonds. One, two. Let's get some stuff out of our inventory here real quick. Get out of here leather. And let's put maybe a chest up. These boots. No, no, no. These boots. I want to keep these boots. So let's see. Um, I guess it's worth trying. Let's see if the pulverizer will crush up these diamonds. It will not. All right. So we're going to have to maybe go through the um, mechanism route. Which one of these is the crusher? I set up a few of my... ME machines that I don't use very much over here. So maybe diamond will crush in here. It will. Cool. Alright, so let's take a look at the recipe real quick while that's crunching up. Diamond dust bronze and jetpack. Cool. So one thing I was noticing with this jetpack is I would have three pieces of armor on like so, but when flying through the nether I was just getting beat to death because I had my biggest piece of armor is being taken up by this jetpack. So hopefully this will afford me some sort of uh, comfort. I don't I don't know the word. It, it'll give me some more protection for sure. So let's put that there, that there, and hopefully these count as bronze. They don't. Okay. Let's take a look at this. How do I make bronze? Yeah, wait, this should totally work. Block of steel, diamond dust. Anything here? Block of steel, bronze ingot, bronze ingot, bronze ingot. Okay, so I need to, these are not gonna work. I need to make some bronze ingots. And let's see here. Maybe the enrichment chamber can help with that. Mechanism's kind of weird, but let's, flip through these recipes by clicking on this middle bar. See if there is a way to make bronze ingots with this. I don't see it. This seems to only make dust. So anyway, screw that. Let's, this might be a bug. Uh, let's look in here for some bronze real quick. Maybe I had some originally. Here we go, bronze. Perfect. I don't know what this Tinker's alloy ingot is going to do for me. At the moment, it's doing nothing. Causing me troubles. So let's try these out real quick. Why is that not working? Okay, block of steel. Steel block, block of steel. Diamond dust. Diamond dust mechanism. Jetpack. Why? Why no work? My guess is this is just a bug and this is not going to work. Oh wait, this is a railcraft block of steel. Well, how do I change? Maybe this needs to be full. Shall we try that? This guy's full. We'll use him instead. Nope, that's not doing it. Diamond dust mechanism, industrial craft 2. Will industrial craft 2 work for this? It must be because it's industrial craft 2. So I need to make an e-mashers. Ah, oh, this is so picky, isn't it? Wait, that's Industrial Craft 2. Why is this being so picky? Block of steel. And I have a Railcraft block of steel, but not a... Wait, this is Railcraft. This will take Railcraft. Wait, no, I'm not looking at the recipe. Maybe it needs to be empty? It can't use a uh, full jetpack? All right, um, I'm going to pause it right here, guys, and see if I can empty out one of these jetpacks, and I'll be right back with you. Okay, guys, we're back. We're going to try a few things to see if we can get this to work. What I'm doing right now is I pulverize some of my steel, nine ingots of it, and I've got it melting down in 
this Tinker's Construct Smeltery. What I'm trying to do is make a different version of the steel block. Currently it says Railcraft on it, and maybe the Railcraft steel block doesn't work with this recipe. I'm not sure. This is just a thing to try. I, I'm currently on hover mode with my jetpack in hopes that it will, yeah, it's almost out of energy. And maybe that's the problem. I don't know. So we're going to wait for these to melt, and we're going to try it with an empty jetpack. And yeah, we'll see if that works. Um, that might be the issue, or it's just a damn bug, and we'll just deal with it. But whatever. Jetpack is down to 300 hydrogen. We should be out here shortly, and these guys are about to melt down as well. So they'll probably both finish about the same time. Wait, why is this guy so far behind? Ah, what a bunch of crap. So yeah, let's let this thing go down to zero. All right, we're out of jetpack juice. That sounds a little weird to say, but let's get these guys melted. Actually, let's run up here and see if it'll work with just the empty jetpack. So yeah, let's jump up here. And maybe that's what the issue is. I'm not sure. So it doesn't work with a full jetpack. So let's take that out of there and let's put in this empty one. That's it. It needed an empty jetpack. Go figure. Okay, so we figured that out. Now we just have to burn all the fuel out of this one. I wish there was a way to dump it, but uh, no, that's it. Let's put on our armored jetpack. Actually, let's look at our, what do you call it? That's my armor bar, I guess. Right now it's up to four and a half shields. When I put the armored jetpack on, it's all the way full. So I'm fully armored now. Let's see what this guy looks like. It just has a little chest pad on the front. Man, I look so weird with this helmet on. Look at that. And like cross-eyed. Hello. Hello. How are you today? Very good. I bite my notes. Very good to see you all. <laughs> all right. So cool. We got that figured out. All we got to do now is power this bad boy up. And we'll be good for flying around in the nether. Get up here. So cool. Anyway, we figured that mystery out. <laughs> That's very good. So now I've got to put this on and stay in hover mode for like ever. And eventually drain it of power too. And then we can make two of these armored jetpacks. And then we'll be totally flying in style. Of course it's raining. Why wouldn't it be? So, uh, as always, guys, I want to thank all of you handsome and gorgeous people for watching. Burt Reynolds is very appreciative as well. And until next time, guys, we'll see you all real soon. Hey, give me a thumbs up, would you? Just one thumbs up. That's all I ask. Do it. Do it.